Hello everyone, Christine Ann here. Welcome back to my channel and to day three of our virtual advent calendar. Today's box is a little bit bigger, so let's see what we have. Okay, our box is a mailer box, a little bigger today. So this is exciting. It's weighty. Um, there might even, I should say, sometimes there might be two things in a box. So that could be exciting as well. Ah. Oh, I remember this one. This is a cool one. Okay, so this is another piece of malachite. I guess it's malachite and azurite, right? There's our sticker. Um, there's a piece of white put on here. I wonder why. Let's... Aha! So it had said malachite after azurite. See that? But a white sticker was put over it because I guess Dan Weinrich thought that um, it wasn't malachite after azurite. It was probably malachite and azurite. Um, so this is from the Copper Queen mine. This is a mine that is now closed. You can go for tours, but you can't go. Uh, they don't mine anymore. This is in Bisbee, Arizona. Um, I've talked about Bisbee before in other videos. So let's see. There's nothing else in the box. So I recall, um, this looks very pretty against the red velvet, huh? I recall this one that Dan, Re Dan Weinrich saying that this was very unusual in his opinion because you have like this bug space here full of malachite. And again, I think these are primary crystals of malachite really probably since given the card that's might have been what he thought as well primary crystals of malachite that formed within this bug but all of this here this is azurite and um let me turn it over here's some azurite crystallized here here's some more malachite you can see areas here where the minerals had all formed there's sort of like a massive state just you know big chunks that probably the miner um, chipped away and broke away so you can see different levels of things there might even be some chrysocolla in here I don't know so it's a big chunk of and look at that that's clearly this was in somebody's collection and it was their number 8,014. So imagine the size of that collection. I don't have anything near the size of that. But you see how the malachite and the azurite, it's all growing together. This color blue, a little paler blue, it's like a sea blue. That could be azurite that just maybe is mixed with some other things um, that looks lighter, I, I don't know. It's a little bit of an ugly baby because um, to me, I love malachite, I love azurite, I love secondary minerals that form from copper, which this is. Um, so I look at it and I think it's wonderful. Somebody might say, why did you spend your money on that? But I'm happy, right? That's all that matters, I'm happy. So yeah, look at this cut face here, this big thick band of azurite, it's probably some malachite under here. Here's the rocky matrix that it probably formed on. So that's what today's sample is. That's a good one. I'm a little bummed that this is here because, you know, if I wanted to display this, I don't want to have 8,014 sticking out. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but it is what it is. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.